In this problem, we're asked to find the general antiderivative of the function of t, uh, 1 plus the square root of t cubed plus 3 over square root of t squared plus 3. So it looks as though we might be able to get some nice cancellation if we um, factor the numerator. We'll better uh, simplify it. So in computing the antiderivative of 1 uh, plus or, this, or computing the antiderivative of this term here, what we can do is we're going to factor out a t um, in the second term in, of the numerator. So we end up with 1 plus t times t squared plus 3, uh, square root of that, over square root of t squared plus 3, and dt. So now this is going to be equal to, uh, let's split this into two terms. So let's take the integral of 1 over the square root of t squared plus 3 uh, dt plus uh, we want the integral of the square root of t times the square root of t squared plus 3 using properties of the square root function over the square root of t squared plus 3 dt. Well, now we have this nice cancellation I was talking about. Those terms cancel out, and we're just left with square root of t. So the first, time, the first term you'll notice um, is just, if we, especially if we write it like this, plus the square root of 3 squared, see that that's just uh, inverse uh, cinch of t over 3. And second term is, well, this is just the integral of t to the 1 half. So um, we raise the power, keep the t, raise the power by 1, so we raise it to 3 halves. And we divide by 3 halves, which is the same as multiplying by 2 thirds. And of course, we need to add a constant. 